Hey, 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 what's up? Time to play some chess. Uh, Vienna game in the house. Uh, let's see if I can remember what to do. Hmm, I think c6. If I'm not mistaken. I hope I didn't mess up. Uh, I can just go d6, right? Oh, he's gonna go... Hold on. I'm gonna go d5. Screw it. I was worried he was gonna go f4. I want to go d6 if his knight's already on f3, I think. But it isn't, so I'm doing this. I hope it's okay. Anyway, somehow this move has startled him greatly, even though it's a very obvious looking move. Uh, I'm going to play this because it looks like it gains a tempo, because d4 is a threat, so I'm developing. And gaining time. Perfect. Perfect situation, right? Alright, let's castle. Look how beautiful my position is, man. All my pieces out in the middle of the board. I love it. Excuse me, I just yawned. Uh, next move, I'm going to go knight c6. And then put my rook in the middle. Bring my bishop out. And eventually win. Because that's how I roll. What did I win my last game, right? I won my last three games, yo. I'm a beast. Ah, uh, let's develop my knight and defend the pawn. I don't know why I thought for an hour in the move knight f3, but for some reason he did. Uh, e4 is interesting next move. Like if castles e4. Very interesting. Um, I'll probably I'll do it. Guy, keep yawning. Uh, I kind of want to keep pieces on the board for some reason. Or maybe I can just... No, I'm just going to go like this. Again, it's a, it's a fast time control. Five minute chess. So I don't want to spend too much time thinking here. Uh, what's up with e4? Is it... He can, uh, and you know what? When in doubt, develop... P, or rookie 8, whatever. I mean, my f7 pawn could get weak in some positions after e4. Like e4 pawn takes pawn takes knight g5. Um... Starts to get annoying. What can you do? Uh, let's go for some checkmating attack. Queen d eight, queen d six, basically, and, and try to put pressure on his king. Mm -hmm. Let's do it like this, I suppose. So now it looks like e four is scary at some point. Knight c three. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna do. Wait, he's attacking my pawn, right? So, oh, it's annoying. Did I mess up? Maybe. I think so. I guess I have to go d d4. Oh, the knight b5. That's really strong. Alright, I totally botched it up. Um, I guess I'm going to have to let him mess up my pawns. Don't know what else to do. He can go knight b5 and then mess up my pawns. Like knight b5, take my bishop, and then take on f6. It's just a big pain in the butt. But, I mean, honestly, the position's not so bad. It's not like he can easily um, do stuff to me. What should I do? Queen d8 or no? Uh, I shouldn't think too long about this move. Let's just put the queen somewhere. Save my time for when I need it. He's going to take. I actually don't think it's that bad, though. I mean, I go king... Oh, he didn't take. Wow. I really thought he would. So now what? Maybe just knight d7? I don't see anything wrong with that. And then just f6. And so he has two bishops, but I have the pawn center still. So everything looks okay for me. Up 30 seconds in the clock still. So happy times. Um, maybe knight... Mm, yeah, let's just take his bishop. If d4, I can take his bishop and go e4. Maybe I should move my king over. Nah, why should I do that? No reason. Uh, I'll put my other rook in the middle. So he wants to go d4 now for real. I'm just going to take and maybe go d4 myself. There's no pins. If knight d4, knight takes. Uh, and I'm going to start to get up some edge in the clock here because the position is maybe okay for me, but like the clock may become very helpful in this game. As you've seen it, 
We've seen it be before. Um, what's this idea here? I don't even know. Oh, he wanted, he wanted to attack my deep pawn, but I'll just defend it with a natural developing move. See, because this e5 pawn is pinned due to his bishop. Uh, uh, I don't know. Kind of like... I don't even know what he's doing. I don't, sorry, I'm just confused. Alright, I'm, I'm just going to go here. I don't know. He wants to go knight d2, probably. Let's make some... So I'm getting confused. Uh, Alright, I'll just put my bishop here. If knight e4... I don't even know. I kind of want to trade queens here. Let's see if he lets me. Nope. Let's put my queen in the middle, like a boss. Uh, g5 could be strong someday. Not right now, though. Not this day. I'm going to move my king now just due to general fear. <laughs> uh, knight e7, it's just knight f6 is a check. I mean, it's a completely useless move, knight f6, but i just generally a little scared. He's probably going to have to... Okay, he does this. Now I'm going to have to outlist this dude. Uh, I should bring my king back to the center where it belongs. I don't know what that move does. He's hitting a wall on a6. Um, I don't even know what he's up to here. What's his plan? I don't see his plan. So I would just improve my position. Still don't see the plan. He must have something in mind. He's, he's making some moves as though he has an idea, but I'm going to stop g5 for now. I'm really going to focus on the clock here. I still don't know what he's up to. He's going to go b4 probably. Oh, I was wrong. Uh, can I? I don't know. Um, take, take b6. Uh... You know what? I give up. I might have been winning. I just don't care. Because I'm going to win on time somehow. Uh, knight b4. Looks annoying. And then I'm going to go bishop c6 and then knight d5. Which gives me the e3 and the f4 squares. So he's starting to run into problems. Uh, bishop a5, b6 should be winning. I'm pretty sure it is. So he's just lost. Uh, oh, it's still go b6, right? I don't even need to, though. I'm just going to... I don't even want to calculate stuff, man. Uh, let's just go rook a8, actually. <laughs> I want to avoid all calculations. When when you're completely winning, uh, or when you're up on time, you just don't want to like calculate anything. You just want to make every move so there's no no nothing hanging, no tricks that he can potentially use. I don't know what that move's going to do. Um, all right, uh, it doesn't really, I don't know what I'm thinking here. There's no threat, really. All right, let's try and trade stuff. Okie doke. I mean, I'm just up a piece, so... I'm going to win. Uh, you know what? Let's defend that pawn. Because I'm greedy. Extremely greedy. Defend it one more time. And do this. <laughs> uh, now I'll make a check. Because he has 8 seconds. So I can just keep doing the same re repetition here. But now I'll stop it. He can't go rook d6 anymore. Bad luck for him. Keep the king out. Um, I don't know why he's still playing, but for some reason he is. And his flag falls. Way to go me. How many more games do I have to play to get on that best list? Three. Because right now I think I'm very high on it. Might it be like right around here. So like number...
9. But I have to play three more games in a short time span, unfortunately. I played okay this game. I made some good practical decisions uh, with the clock and, and my position. You know, I always seemed to be okay, and I was always you know, doing all right on the clock, too. So, for the most part, um, felt like a solid win. But that's four in a row. After that disaster loss to um, the 81-year-old the GM. So, thanks, guys, for watching. I'll see you tomorrow with another five-minute game. Peace out. Bye-bye.